Hey guys, it's August down here in South Alabama. Man, it's hot. We're sitting under the bridge right now, getting a little shade. Uh, we're going to talk about one of the new baits that uh, Missile Baits come out with this year. It's the 48 worm. And uh, talk about some of the ways I like to rig it. And uh, you know, when it's hot like this in the summer, one of the few ways you can get bites sometimes on these tough lakes is skipping docks with a finesse worm type bait. And uh, you can do that with the 48 in several different ways. The lake we're on is really dirty. Uh, we've had a lot of rain this year. I'm going to choose a super bug color that Missile Baits has got. It's basically it's black, black and blue on one side, green pumpkin blue on the other. And uh, that's going to show up good in this dirty water. All these fish are hanging around these docks eating brim and uh, just kind of suspending up under these docks using the shade during this hot part of the day. And uh, one way you can rig this bait is uh, a flick shake technique. It's basically a wacky jig head. Uh, this one's got a brush guard on it. And uh, take this bait and just hook this bait right in the middle like this. And uh, got this on a spinning outfit with 8 pound Seaguar and Vizex uh, tied to 15 pound Seaguar braid. 6'9 um, medium Fitzgerald spinning rod and a loose spinning reel. It's going to get the job done for you. Uh, another way you can rig this up, if you want to use casting gear, or just for a little bit different presentation, is uh, got this on a bait caster with 15 pound Seaguar and Vizex, and uh, just a weighted swim bait hook. This has got a, uh, I believe this is a 30 second ounce in this swim bait hook with a screw lock head. And you'll notice this 48 worm has a fat end and it has a skinnier end. I'm actually going to rig it on the skinny end so the fat end's down. And this bait's going to shimmy and have a glide to it when you skip it under these docks. So you just screw it in on your screw lock. And so you're just rigging it Texas style basically with this weighted hook. And you see I got the fat end down. So we're just going to rig it like this. Text throws that hook on top. Looks like that. We're going to go out here and get after some, see if we can't catch us one. Do it right there on the 48, baby. There's your 